Hi YouTube, this is Julie. Uh, I never show my face on video, especially on YouTube. So this is a big deal for me. Um, I thought about relaxing my hair today. I mean, I have been natural for three, no, four years and I have 4C hair, which means that it shrinks up, uh, you know, 50, 75% so that you really don't see the growth unless it's uh, completely stretched or um, straightened. So uh, that is my issue for today, is that I thought about it and uh, almost went out and got a... Uh, a box or you know a relaxer kit because uh, you know I guess I get frustrated sometimes but I talked with my husband and he is uh, very supportive and said don't do it just be patient and wait for your hair to grow in and to be able to show the length that it has um, so for now I have uh, no more thoughts of relaxing. But uh, anyway, this is uh, a style that I do all the time, twists. I either do the two-strand twists or um, braids. You know, I might do, you know, tiny braids that are, you know, half the size of these. And, um, I do a lot of like ponytails, like I pull my hair back, slick it back and, and do a ponytail. Um, let's see, what else do I do? Um, sometimes I do buns, like I'll do two buns on top and um, you know, basically that's it. Uh, right now my, my ends aren't looking that great. They're all scraggly and I might probably need a trim but no matter w what I do to them they they always seem to look like this even if I trim it just the puffy ends you know I'll moisturize I'll gel I'll put conditioner on it and it still looks bushy like this just dry and puffed out so those are some issues that I have with my hair. Um, it shrinks up like mm, 50 to, I'm going to say, 100%. Because <laughs> you should see it. You know, my, my hair, you know, will be this length. And it'll be this length when wet. But then once it's completely dry, I mean, it just completely just, it's just completely shrunken. So you don't even see any of the length. And some, some people ask me, oh, do you, did you cut your hair? I'm like, no, it's just a shrunken afro. So those are the issues that I have with my hair. Um, I have been um, natural for four years. I've been watching YouTube for uh, probably about four and a half years. And also um, natural, naturality. Yeah, with D. Coily, yes, the owner. Um, I've been watching and commenting and just being a part of them for, hmm, I would say about 15 years, you know, because um, my son, who is now 15, um, what am I trying to say? Um, I've been watching them since my son was born, so I... Um, have been on, you know, watching the natural scene for quite some time, but haven't been fully on board with it. As you can see, my hair would have been longer if, if I had been, if I stuck to it for uh, 14 years. My hair, you know, should be much longer than this. But I've gone back to relaxing and, you know, regretted it and said, let me go natural again, so... 
uh, you know, how we, we get fickle and sometimes we just say, oh, you know, I need a change. I need to do something with my hair other than this. And you get tired of, of, of this, you know, the styles that you're doing and, you know, the hair, you know, is not showing its, its full length. So you just say, let me do something different. Let me show off my length a little bit, but uh, not today. So if uh, any of you ladies out there that are Bible-believing Christians, if you could just pray for me and my hair so that I will just keep on with the, with the natural uh, lifestyle because I think it's the best for us is to go natural without using chemicals and just um, being our natural selves. I think that's the best thing. I mean, we, we need to just be real and be true to ourselves. So if anybody has any questions or comments about anything I'm saying, please feel free to, to comment in the box below and um, I'll see you on the YouTube. Peace.